Hi, it's Stephen Caleb with Brown Elves here, back with another episode of Smithbusters. And Caleb, what is on your mind today? Something has been eating at you. Today's myth is that uh, wearing matching shirts is tight. Fine. Fine, we're tight. Okay. Yeah, no, busted. We're done here. No, uh, so today's myth, in all seriousness, we'll keep it firearm related and not clothing Thank you. related, um, is that... All right, well, let me just kind of back up a little bit here, and I'm going to ask you a question. Have you seen the AR-15s with, as as how the kids would say, cringe, like vinyl lo logos or like um, laser engraved? Some go to yeah, I've space. seen some stuff that made me cringe. Let me ask you a question. Do you know what the uh, do you know what I think it's pronounced waifu? What waifu? Waifu? You know no what idea. that is? It's like sushi, right? I wish. So no, it's a. Um, it's an anime character that one is feels attraction to. No wonder I'm lost. Okay. Yeah, so, uh, you know, I'll, I'll try and keep you up to speed as much as I can <laughs> Thank here. Thank you. So, people are getting uh, these waifu, waifu, whatever. Yeah, I'm probably saying it wrong. doesn't matter. You get what I'm saying, so I'm saying it. So, they'll get these, like, vinyl stickers and put them on their AR-15s. Or, like, okay. they have, like, tactical patches. They'll put on, like, their plate carrier and stuff. Like Hello Kitty. Yes. Oh, there, I get it. I, I get it now. I, I should have, yeah. <laughs> I'm there. I'm right there with you now. Okay, so it's basically the equivalent of making like a Hello Kitty's logo to stick on your AR. Hmm. And for, we don't have one here. This is my, uh, we didn't have any in the studio I could, I could present as an example. However, I'll give, uh, I'll give our editor here some screen grabs to either picture in picture or just throw up on, you'll, you'll see, All don't right. worry. So, and it doesn't stop there. So they'll do that, that, um, and th these guns get roasted all the time on like Reddit and Facebook and stuff, which is why I'm bringing it oh, up. I'm not surprised. And I'm not, I'm not roasting them. I'm just painting the picture here, but they'll do that. They'll do, um, some really, again, as the kids say, cringe paint jobs. Like uh, I saw one recently that was like the, like a, a DeWalt version of an AR-15. Oh. If you could picture it in your mind. Creative. Very creative, yes. Um, and then there's, uh, like you have your, like your Mandalorian theme stuff. Oh, of course. Star Wars theme. Of course. I've seen some Star Trek theme stuff out there. Uh, so it's kind of a weird line that, that gets drawn because like a lot of people support painting your firearm. But then like if you go a little bit too personal of like stuff that you're into then all of a sudden it becomes like it, it becomes cringe and now you're the, you're the you're the topic of a so this, this is more about art than anything this is yeah so i've always said it you know firearms are are functional art you know yeah it, this is a this is a canvas to express yourself so what i'm getting at here and my opinion on the topic regardless of you know what you want to put on your ar-15 Keyword there being your, it's your gun. Yeah. Do whatever you want. It doesn't really matter. Like people will get really upset when they see their guns as the topic of one of these posts, and it doesn't matter. It's not really for them. You it's know? like your car. It's just like you put your... any bumper sticker on there you want or any paint job. Yeah, I mean, do whatever. You put whatever logo you want on your AR-15, and unless it's the like Socialist Rifle Association logo or something, I don't know. Okay. But. Okay. So basically, the message is: you be you, follow your bliss. You do you, boo. All right. And as you know, the Rock Dwayne Johnson used to say back in the day, it doesn't matter. Remember that song? He did like this whole song with. Uh, I must have missed that. Yeah, that, you guys will know what I'm talking about. All right. Yeah. So, was there a myth here? The, yeah, the myth is that you shouldn't do any of that, and basically the the. This goes, I mean, this, is, this just comes back to sensitivity in general. Uh, the myth is that you should care what other people think, and you really shouldn't. All right. Yeah, do whatever you want to do. If you have a comment, if you have a particularly cringeworthy piece of art you'd like to show us. Hey. <laughs> hey. Show me the cringe. That's right. Anyway, let us know what you think. Hit that like and subscribe button, and we promise we'll see you next time with another episode of Smithbusters.